Hi, I'm Marna. This is the Dolls Rescue Channel, and I'm going to try to talk fast because I have a lot to show you this morning. First of all, I got a pattern. I made this pattern for, I know, I know, it's a spring color, but it's what I had. I love this yarn. It is velvet, and it is so soft and so nice, and I made this little dress pattern. It's a little halter. I know it's a spring dress, but I'm <laughs> Does it count I'm going to do it in brown? <laughs> anyway, I was glad that I could get it done, and I did it more than once. I actually did three, and I really like the pattern. I think they look cute in it. And look, the way that I made it, the hemline, let me see if I can fold it the way it's supposed to. There we go. Folds like flower petals. The hemline looks correct with the big belly. And I, what I did is I increased stitches and it worked out really well, I think. Stand up in your stand, sweetie pie. Now, I have a haul. I mean, I have a haul. I'm so spoiled. Let me move some stuff back so that I can show you what I got. We went shopping Friday. No, we went shopping Monday on Halloween. And this is what we wore. And I, let's see, what did we buy at, while we were out? I got my downy for my hair, a doll's hair. Remember, I was out. I bought more of these beads for pull strings. I, I love these beads. I love that you get the um, bead caps in that and spacers. I really like these, $3.98 for three strands at Walmart, and I just think they're pretty. Uh, buy snaps when you find them. They're getting harder to find and more expensive. So I bought one. I think they only had the one. I bought this, uh, got it up to the register. It was only a dollar. I don't know why, except this is frayed. I, I, I don't even wanna talk about it, but I got that. I'm gonna wash it and use it. Um, this is what was in our mailbox when we came home, and I'm thrilled about that. I bought some fabric. Yeah, I know, I have fabric. You, I have as much fabric as the fabric stores, I think, but it was on sale, and I like a variety, and I have all these projects going on. Look at this tiger print. Isn't that cute? Won't that be cute made into a, a dress or a skirt, like a little gathered skirt? I thought that would be cute. The Christmas print, this, was this Hobby Lobby or, yeah, this is Hobby Lobby. And some of these were $3 a yard, like this one. So I got another yard and I got this, not because it's my favorite, although I really like it, but it look at the tiny print. That's good for a, a midi or a mini or any of your little dolls. Uh, <clears throat> same here, $3 a yard, I love the uh, leopard print, I got another yard. Yes, I just bought this, but it's the, what they're doing is they're closing these out. They will not have them again. This, same thing, $3 a yard. Um, I love this 70s-ish print. Uh, same here, $3 a yard. I only get a quarter yard of it because I don't need a whole lot. I got this. Was this one on sale? I can't remember, but I needed it. This was $3 a yard. Darren encouraged me to get more. I'm always looking for bicycle fabric. I make uh, pillowcases and well, all, all kinds of stuff out of that. Plus, how cute will that be on uh, American Girl doll? And then they had this. This was like $7 a yard, 66% off. It is a stretch uh, velvet. And I want to make... Uh, my Renaissance doll, a um, cape out of that. Who, by the way, J Dolls UK came up with a perfect name, Ren. And it's a hat tip to Serenata, who has a doll named Ren. And I, I love that doll. Although she spells it like the bird, W R E N, and I'm going to spell it like Renaissance. Um, so she's named, and she's going to get a cape. Um, went to Joanne's, God love my husband. He took me to Joanne's. I spent a bunch of money there. And then he's like, do you want to go to Hobby Lobby? I'm like, well, I sure spent a lot of money. And he pulls in Hobby Lobby and pulls out his wallet again. I love gingerbread and they seem to be a thing this 
uh, Christmas. So I bought a little of this. This will work for the Neo size Blyce, only because they're so doggone whimsical. That'll be cute, cute, cute. But really cute for, um, again, American girls, all of those size dolls. Look at this. I, oh, I love this. I got a full yard of it. It, it is so stinking cute. And those gnomes for Christmas, how fun. Again, I got this one because it is a small print and I'm working with the uh, Midi and Mini Blyce. And I think, I think, and I'm gonna try, you know the dress that the Mini Blyce come in? If you lay that on fabric, pick your piece that you want right in the center, line that up dead center, lay your little uh, dress they come in on here, pin it down, cut it out, uh, then run fray check around the edges, cut your little armholes out, run fray check, put your closure in the back. You can call that a little dress. And, it, and it's really cute. I like that print. I think the little whimsical minis could get away with it. Same here. I love this. I don't know if you can see it. I'm going to move it a little bit. This has um, glitter. In, I don't know what you call it. It's glitter of some sort embedded, which makes the snow look more like snow. And then they had this Peter Rabbit, which I absolutely love. Make gonna make two dresses out of that. And what else did I get? When we left here, oh, and I bought thread. Buy thread when you see it, buy what you need. I, I just cannot get over how every time I walk into, well, anywhere, the prices have gone up. We left here on our Kinder Blythe hunt. We're doing it for fun. I would love to find a Kenner Blythe in the wild, uh, you know, for a reasonable price. Will it happen? You know what, it could. People have, people are, I just hope it's me. I didn't find a Kenner Blythe, but I found a Blythe. We went to an antique store. I've been looking at her for a while there. Um, I love this girl. This is the littlest, littlest pet shop made by Hasbro. Um, Blythe doll. Isn't that cute? I, did, I haven't bought her in the past. Her little uh, ticket is still on. Um, I haven't bought her in the past there because I was hoping to find her with the ice skates. I love a doll with skates, but she has everything else. Such a cute little doll. Uh, I bought her. She was, oh, I can't even remember what she was, less than do you remember what she cost? I thought she was 12 Yeah, I think she was $12. So worth it. Worth it, worth it, worth it. She will join my collection. I have several. <clears throat> excuse me, my throat is sore. Um, I have several uh, little Littlest Pet Store blocks. This has got me puzzled because I don't remember getting... Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll bet... My order said a doll came, and it did not. This is actually two days. And they came the day before, but the next order that said it came yesterday did not. Oh, I did order this. Okay. This is a little top that I bought for, <clears throat> for Ruth 66 uh, to wear on her little trips on Highway 66. Thought that was cute. She can wear that with a skirt or pants or even under a dress would be cute. Oh, look at this. Ha, ha, ha. I love it when there's a lot of packages. Christmas. It's like Christmas. All right. I have to open these slow and easy, but I am trying to hurry so that you can see what I did get. Feels like something else in there. Kind of does, though, with some of these thicker packages, and I'm glad they do that. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Not going to show you this, but I can't tell you how tickled I am for a collab. So I'm going to put that to the side, and I have some really fun collabs coming up, uh, hopefully before Christmas. Oh, here's another deck of cards in the one, I think it's 112 scale, but they do work for the 1 6 scale. Uh, and that's what I bought it for, the Blythe dolls. But if you look at those, you could use those for the Neo Blythe or even the um, Mid-D Blythe. 
I got some more coats. Oh, these are different. Look very different than the, <coughs> excuse me, than the uh, picture in on the page. But let's take a look. Yeah, that's, it's still fuzzy and soft though. It's like uh, velvet. How cute is that? We might try that on a doll in a minute. I've been gathering those up for a purpose. And I'm going to have to make some for my chubby blice. They won't get in those. Okay, this is not what I ordered. I did not order these socks. Maybe it's a free gift if uh, something's wrong. But it, they will fit one of my AG dolls, but it makes me angry when they don't get my orders right. So I want to hang on to that bag. But look at this. That'd be cute on peaches. We'll get some pictures of her. I need to get her up on my new website, Whimsical Blythe. Uh, I need to work on it. I've just been, I don't know where the time's going. I really have, I sew about every single day. Okay, these are different. But I got a gift of two pairs of shoes and because those are flat sandals, they will fit the Neo Blythe dolls. I, I bought some of those to try them, and they work. These are cute. I bought these for my Blythe, my Neo Blythe. What I really bought it for is I thought the I thought the colors were a little different. Again, I was buying a sweater. This didn't get turned turned inside out. I bought this for Ruth sixty six. Uh, you know the old sweater song and uh, it looked like a nice tight long sleeve sweater so we'll see and these look like oh those are different that's real uh, real thin we'll try those on her but I got extra because they look cute and let's see what else we got I, you know I don't just have Blythe and Blythe clothes Tubs full. Many of my dolls have their own outfits. In fact, most. You know, like Daisy has all kinds of adventure clothes, and, and Rue 66 is getting 1950s clothes. Um, Birdie has to have clothes that go with her hair and their personalities. I'm sure some of you do the same. Oh, okay, cool. I buy these boots because there's so much you can do with them. I, they're for the Neo Size Blythe. They have a little red heart on them, but I have taken uh, a, um, uh, well, all colors of uh, permanent markers and colored those and then changed out the shoestrings with a um, embroidery thread. And I got some elf ears. I got those because I'm planning on using the other pair I got and I don't want a collab or idea to come up and not have them. They too, AliExpress um, prices are really going up. They do have a sale on right now. Another pair of the white boots. I have uh, some ideas for those. Okay, let's keep going because I know you want me to get to those dolls and see what I did get. One is for a gift uh, for a dear friend of mine. Let's see, there's a bunch of packages in here. Oh, that's all right, that kind of thing. I hope that this is just a free gift and not I was supposed to get another sweater, which I kind of think I was. We'll see. And that's another one. Peaches, she dresses like the 1970s. Oh, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I had bought these. I just said that these will fit the Blythe. I had bought these for a purpose. And there they are. I like those. I like those a lot. They're cute uh, on the Blythe, the Neo Blythe dolls. They also fit the flat, flat footed Barbie who often comes without shoes because there are so few. Oh, cool. More of the Wednesday Adams fabric. I've been using a lot of that. And 
I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying. I don't want to tear or rip anything, and I want to see what I did get. What is in here? Oh, stylus. I have to have those for my bear paws or you cannot read my messages at all. Well, you can't anyway, but at least I'm trying with those. Okay, especially in the car. I got my bear paws and I'm doing this on the little keyboard. Oh, frustrating. Oh, another one of these coats. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Now let's get this one open. And I, I think it might be a coat too, but I'm not, oh, careful, careful. Oh, I caught the corner of something there. Uh, that's why I hate using scissors, but I sure can't use a knife. I'd have a cut from here to there. Yes, it is a black fuzzy coat. I love these. These, let's see if this one's as soft as the others. Ooh, that one's a little shedding. I'm gonna keep the black back here. Oh yeah, that's, it's soft, not as soft as the others, but isn't that cute and rich? Is that cut straight? I don't think it is. It looks like they hack that. That's okay, I have scissors. Let me put that back in here, because boy, this one is really shedding. I don't think there's a job called quality control anymore. I think that's a thing of the past. All right, this one has some stuff in it. I'm real anxious to get in. I think it's this one. Uh, and show you what's in there. Yep, there's some stuff in here. You know, AliExpress, I rarely, I hope this is a free gift. I buy a lot from them. I see other people, and they get all these free gifts and clothes and shoes and all. Well, I did get those too. But I don't normally get a free gift. This is not the one I was going to open first. That's all right. We're going to open it. Let's see. Oh, this is earrings. I love these little, look at these little balls. You can make, uh, oh, what are those called? Mini brand balls for your dolls with these. Pop it open and earrings inside. I've been buying the Adams Family for the um, Wednesday Adams dolls I've been making. I have a couple to get up on my website real soon for sale. Uh, but I've got another dress to make for one. Uh, when, when I sell them, I, I sell them with more than one outfit. Oh, another one. Cool. Now my dolls could have two. You can do all kinds of things with these. This could become a soccer ball for a midi. I mean, there's a lot you can do with these little containers. I rather like them for earring holders, too. You know, the intended purpose. These are very cute. This is a nod on the Wednesday Adams to Tim Burton for the Nightmare Before Christmas. Well, many of us like the Nightmare Before Christmas. Those are cute, aren't they? It'd be real cute in one of my Blythe doll's ears or my uh, Rainbow High dolls, Shadow High dolls. How about that? All right. I do hope that other doll shows up today. I, I'm very concerned about it. Let's see. Oh, okay. This goes to someone with a doll. How cute is this? I think, wow, that is a nicer coat and really soft. I mean, like ultra soft. And it comes with this outfit, this little dress, which I absolutely love. I have this dress for my own dolls at uh, Easter. Oh, I don't want to do that because I'm sending it on. Oh, dang it. Here we go. Boy, I can never find those ends. I say it all the time. How cute is this with the little rabbit? It has the hearts. Oh, they got the hearts going the opposite direction. Mine go downward as they should, but it's still really cute. Valentine's Day, Easter, any day of the year. Uh, mostly spring and summer, but what a cute dress. What a cute duel. I got that for right at $3. I think it was uh, uh, 280 something for the pair. I can't make it for that, to be honest. Uh-oh, I think I just might have cut something. Woo! No. I'm good. Oh, and a pair of black boots. 
They, you probably can't see them because they're black, but I got a pair of those. Uh, like I said, you can do so many things. I'm gonna go ahead and open this one and show you what I got her. This doll is going off in the mail very soon. I'm gonna make her a couple things, print out some patterns for the person it's going to. And oh, look, I got one for me. I told Darren, I said, oh, when I ordered, I said, oh, it looks like I slipped and got two. And he said, oh, that's good, one for you. Okay. One for me, one for you, two for me, three for me. I love these dolls, I really do. I don't take them all out of their packages and I am gonna do some customs and sell them, but mostly they are for me. Let's see if her eyes work well. Yep, oh, she's cute. I love, love, love this rose gold hair. Yes, I already had one and I named her Brandy. But uh, I really like her, and sometimes when I like a doll, I get more than one. I will check these other eyes off camera because this is getting kind of long, and we haven't even opened the last package. It's a big haul. Okay. All righty. Let's see what's in here. And they came with hands. I should have said that, too. I got the hands with them. Uh, and those are going to go on to her. I've got a lot to get off in the mail, I'll tell you. Is this the one I just split? Yes. Okay. Oh, these are cute. I have, oh, this is different, though, than the one that I have. These are cute, cute, cute little dresses. These are less than $5 on, um... This one's not made near as well as the one I got before. AliExpress, but what a cute little dress for a uh, Blythe doll. Really like them. Boy, that's not made as well. And the fabric, they're showing their old pictures in the uh, photos for the sale. They're more of a turquoise, which I like better. Baby turquoise. But I like it for less than $5. I'm, I'm good with that. Oh, I got more eyes, more eye chips, and I've got these dolls I'm doing, and they're going to need pink eyes. I don't like the pink eyes that come with the doll, but I do like these. So they're going to get those, and probably those, and probably a blue. The eye, these are different, and I really like them. So I got eye chips. God knows I need them for all the dolls coming in. And I'm going to be busy. And you know what? It keeps me happy and healthy, especially in my mind, having a good hobby like ours, the doll hobby. Keeping busy, uh, making clothes on the YouTube, talking, chatting with you all. It's a wonderful hobby, and this is a wonderful community. Oh, good. This is a dress I have been waiting for. Kind of a rainbow, but a tie-dye rainbow. Oh gosh, she'd be cute in this. This is not her coat, but look at this. Oh my God, that is so soft. Isn't that cute? Oh my goodness, that's cute. Really like it. All right, let's put this underneath and this should be, I hope, one of my chubby Blythe heads on a body that I will use for something else. My Gothia, my um, Gothia Blythe, poor thing. She has that ball jointed body, Blythe body, and I hate those. I won't buy them anymore. I don't care if they're $10, I won't buy them anymore. They do not last. The doll's hip joints go out. We've worked on her twice. So we're gonna try to put a head joint in her and put her on one of these bodies that uh, these girls come in. Oh my goodness, she is cute. Get a close up. We have a broken leg. We stopped filming and I rec recommend you do this too. 
We stopped filming so I could take a picture and show I have not yet opened this to send it to the seller because sometimes I had a leg come that it snapped back in, but after that, it was weak. And nothing I could do about it because time had gone by. Now, if you buy an Icy doll on uh, AliExpress or anywhere else, the bodies are loose at the head. And you just need to know that if you're not gonna change the body out, you will need to make some adjustments because I know when my first, the first Icy Heads I bought were my boys, and uh, my boy Blyce, and more and more and more their heads look down. Uh, but we've got that fixed with some neck joints. Okay, here are her eyes, pink. Oh, the old purple, I will leave those. I like the purple. Brown and amber why amber i don't know but look at that purple i like it and that's what i got today so the other doll did not show up that they have marked off on my delivered to mailbox hopefully it comes today i will let you know thank you for watching the dolls rescue channel please leave a like a comment and subscribe